Hey guys, my name is Norman from Cortex R&D. Today I want to show you the new improved bulk edit feature. I've covered this already in part one, but it's been modified uh, significantly in the last few days and I would like to show you again, walk through the process and the new method of working with this. One of the great improvements that were made is that bulk edit now supports all field types. In this example, we will deal with date times that are the most complex one with the repeat and end time that takes into account the date and also the time and connections that are multi many to many though so multiple selection connected fields <laughs> and the ratings multiple choice yes no and even rich text Okay, so first thing to do is to create yourself a new account, a user role called bulk edit. <laughs> I don't know why it's like import by default. It should be from scratch, but bulk edit. And assign this to yourself or very trusty users. Bulk edit. And from that point, and of course, uh, the table must have inline editing enabled. Refresh. Okay, so now we have those check boxes. <clears throat> First thing to decide is what you want to modify. I'm going to zoom out a little bit. Not too much. Okay. So you choose the fields you want to be modified. So let's say four, five, and six. And when you move your cursor, you see that it becomes a crosshair like this, like a target that indicates what you want to copy from. It's going to be the source. So let's say I copy um, the five stars rating. Well, if I click on in anywhere in that cell, it's going to copy the value to those three fields at the bottom. Now, that's when you have only one field to modify, but what is nice is that you can also modify several fields. Let's say this one, this one, and this one, but you want to modify the store owners. Now you see the highlighted selection, the open days, the services. Now let's go for everything charity and that cutie so when you have multiple columns selected at that moment if you click anywhere in a row it's going to copy everything to the destination it doesn't matter where you click okay you can, you can even click on in non-editable fields like this one so if i click here okay anywhere in that row it's going to take all the fields that are checked and copy them to the target So we can see that everything has been updated. So that's it. I hope you like it. My name is Norman from Cortex R&D and thanks for watching.